Welcome to Medicom. We've been advancing diagnostic cardiology since 1981. Medicom presents a patient guide for the Savvy Wireless Mobile Cardiac Telemetry System. Your doctor has prescribed the Savvy Wireless Monitoring Procedure and entrusted Medicom to help identify any possible cardiac arrhythmias. The Savvy Wireless Monitor you'll be using during the next 30 days is equipped with artificial intelligence that can automatically capture and transmit cardiac events via the cellular network to Medicom's Cardiac Monitoring Center. This video provides all the information you need for proper use and handling of the monitor during your testing period. Please note, this information, as well as more detailed instructions, is also available in the patient guide located in your Savvy Wireless Kit. We recommend you review the patient guide. About the mobile cardiac telemetry monitoring, how the process works. The Savvy Wireless Monitor will allow you to record your own electrocardiogram, also known as ECG, when you feel a symptom and the information will be sent via the cellular network to Medicom's 24-hour cardiac monitoring center. Our team of cardiac specialists is on hand 24 hours a day, seven days a week to receive and review your ECG data and forward a report to your doctor. In the kit you'll find the following items. The Savvy Wireless Pendant, Smartphone, Smartphone Holster, The Patient Guide, Pendant Belt Clip, AA Batteries, Smartphone charger, patient survey, patient cable, electrodes, lanyard, and a prepaid shipping envelope to mail the entire kit back to Medicomp when the procedure is complete. Let's first become familiar with the smartphone. There are a few buttons you will use throughout your 30-day procedure. On off button, left soft key, right soft key, select key, directional arrows, and back key. There is also a charging port. The smartphone has been configured for cardiac telemetry functions only and cannot be used as a standard phone. Now let's become familiar with the pendant. The pendant has an on-off button, symptom button, patient cable, patient cable connector, and lanyard hook. Connecting yourself to the pendant. Your doctor's office may have connected you to the monitor, but let's take a moment to review the process on how to connect yourself. The center of the patch should be within the areas indicated by the boxes. The number of electrodes you are wearing may vary from those shown, but in most cases you'll be wearing three electrodes. Before applying the electrode patches, follow the steps one through three on how to prepare your skin. The type of electrodes you are using may vary from those shown, but the functionality is the same. Step 1. Choose areas of your chest that are flat and not very muscular. Avoid skin folds or creases, irritated skin or scar tissue. Step 2. If necessary, shave areas that have hair using the skin patch as a guide for the size of area to shave. This ensures good contact and makes electrode removal much easier. Step 3. Wash area thoroughly with plain soap and water. If possible, try to avoid soap that contains lotion or oil. Dry the area well. Applying the electrode patches. Find the patient cable. Snap the white wire onto the electrode. Peel it from the plastic backing and apply it to your chest as shown. Repeat the process for the remaining wires. Remember, white on right when applying electrodes. This will help you remember to always place the white electrode on the upper right side of your chest. We recommend that you change your electrodes every two days, moving their location slightly to prevent skin irritation. Install a fresh battery into the pendant. The pendant operates on one AA alkaline battery and will beep periodically to alert you when the battery is getting low. Follow these steps when installing a new battery. The location of the battery compartment is on the back of the pendant. Slide the battery door in the direction of the embossed arrow to remove the battery. Use the ribbon attached if needed. 
Insert a new battery using the embossed picture inside the compartment as your guide. Align the cover to the compartment and slide the back door into position. Both the pendant and the smartphone will alert you during the course of the procedure when the battery is low. Next, turn on the pendant. Press and hold the on-off button located on the right side of the pendant for a few seconds. Wait until the unit beeps and flashes a blue light, followed by a blinking green light. This indicates that the unit has successfully turned on. Plug the connector that joins the wires into the top of the pendant. The connector only fits one way. Turn the smartphone on by pressing the power button located on the left side. The smartphone will run through its initialization until the main screen appears. Press the left soft key under the start procedure. The next screen will give instructions on applying the electrode patches. Next, press the left soft key under OK on the smartphone and go to the next step. The smartphone and pendant communicate via Bluetooth technology. A busy indicator appears on the smartphone screen while they connect. You'll see a screen labeled Current Procedure Settings. The standard settings for an adult are preset into the smartphone. If you have a pacemaker, please reference the patient guide for instructions. If you do not have a pacemaker, press the left soft key under Accept Settings. A busy indicator appears while the smartphone is initialized and learns your ECG signal. Once the pendant is linked with the smartphone, the ECG waveform disappears from the screen and monitoring with the current time appears. Once the initial setup is complete, the monitor will automatically begin to monitor your ECG. Your Savvy Wireless procedure has now begun. If you see something other than monitoring, leave the electrodes on your skin for 15 minutes and try the setup again. If you need assistance with your procedure setup, please contact Medicomp's Cardiac Monitoring Center 24 hours a day, toll free, at 1-888-432-7818 using a phone other than the smartphone. Wearing the Savvy Wireless. It's important that you keep the Savvy Wireless hooked up to you at all times and be sure a symptom button is easily and quickly accessible. Wear the Savvy Wireless pendant and smartphone where it's most convenient. On your waist using the belt clips, in a readily accessible pocket, or wearing the pendant around your neck using the lanyard provided. Try to keep the smartphone and pendant within 10 feet as much as possible. The pendant will continue to capture your ECG, even if it's temporarily away from the smartphone, but it cannot be sent to Medicomp until you're once again within range of the smartphone. Please do not use the lanyard while sleeping or operating machinery. A note of caution, the Savvy Wireless should be worn outside your clothing if there's any chance that perspiration might come in contact with the unit. The unit should also be protected during wet or cold weather conditions.